everyone, welcome back. I'm Honeywell and we're playing Overcrowd. We're on day two, or just about to be on day two of our zone two station. Uh, so we're still very much in our infancy here. Um, I put in a water cooler. It turns out I watched Phillips over here. Uh, they only, the T station, while it gives them that little speed boost, it also only relieves 10 thirst, whereas the water recooler relieves 20 so I went ahead and put in a water cooler over here and uh, in the hopes that our staff will take care of their thirst I don't know if they'll be drawn to the water water cooler or not but we will see um, I'm not really happy with the way our lobby looks because you know it's ugly let's put let's move this over here let us get since we have that 2,000 pounds that we received for Uh, for 100 station wrap, let us let us put in another ticket machine. Another ticket machine. Let's expand our tool room for more generators because we receive that uh, debuff now to our station wrap for construction during the day. So let's try and, you know, abide by the rules here. Do we have enough to, we already have eight bonds. How many do we need for our five carriages? Seven bonds. Do we have enough power for that? Let's see. Oops, where is our report? Because when we increase this to five carriages, it's going to increase our power consumption. You know what? First things first. Let's do this. Wait, one, two, three. One, two. Oh, we have those tiles that we put on the ground. Let's raise those back up. What is it? Uh, left raise? Yes, please. Come back. Right to lower, there we go. So now there is plenty of room for that and we don't need these three down here. So let's get rid of those. 1300 pounds. I would like our station to be, our platform area here to be four tiles wide. So let's see if we can do that. And we're going to need another light for sure. So let's see. That one is good. One, two, three, four, five. So that is good. Should we put... That is good. Um, we still have a thousand pounds... So we have money to buy a generator if we need to. You know me, very cautious. Yes, please, do that. So now we have five carriages. Can we see how much power this takes? No, not really. Power consumption, three kilowatts. That's not much. So we have a nice large platform. We have this we still have a thousand pounds we have three ticket machines um do you know what let's let's rearrange our trash cans a bit because these people are supposed to be disgusting pigs like they are at every station here so let's encourage them not to be There we go. One of the other things that I noticed from the last time we played. Um, now I'm kind of used to The Sims where the objects themselves have like an attraction score. And I don't think they work that way in this game. I think the um, commuters themselves um, have needs and they'll search out what they want. If I'm 
what little I read about it, if I'm understanding it correctly. So when the last station where I tried changing the, like the directions of, of the little hot dog stands, I don't think that matters for this game. Like I was, I was working under the impression like they might access it more if it was facing more convenient in their line of path uh, sort of thing, but I don't think it works that way. So we are not gonna worry about that. But our commuters were hungry. So let's get them a little hot dog stand. A little hot dog stand. And I would like to buy some adverts too. But I think this is enough for now. Or how much does a coffee cart? Uh, the sooner we get the, oh, we don't have enough money. <laughs> the sooner we get our adverts in, the sooner they start making more money for us. They also increase the sales of all of our carts. Um, but we're gonna try this right now because I think it's probably a better idea to go for to go for the sales themselves instead of just a, oh, nice. Good job, Lewis. And uh, go, go take a drink from the water cooler. And she just leveled up. Very nice. She's so tired. Um, I think we wanted, to, we were working on giving her more stamina. I think is what we decided for Lexi because she carries around the information tablet. Yes, so let's do that for her. Phillips, are you good? Oh, do you know what? I wanted to get them that couch. They have a sofa now. Cannot afford bonds too. As soon as they get a bonds, uh, as soon as we get a bond, we'll go ahead and buy that couch for us, for them. But there we go. I don't think we're going to need to do any other construction. Oh, one more light. One more light. And we'll, even though it is not going to matter, we'll try and abide by the rules there. Um, you know, no construction during the day sort of thing. We'll see how that goes. I mean, a drunk has entered the station. I wonder if she'll stay drunk. She probably will because we don't have a mop. So, of course, she's going to. Isn't that the way? Lewis. Phillips and Lewis, how did you, why did you switch directions? Um, uh, yeah, I don't like this at all. Uh, Lewis? Lewis, go home. Yeah. <laughs> Lewis, go home. And we need, Phillips, come out here. Oh, oh, so this is the second time. The first commuter that comes in the door, they just lose their designation, uh, which is good for us because I didn't want to have to buy a mop and deal with vomit, which also spreads uh, disease. So we have three commuters here. Let's double check to make sure we have our carriage here. Stock three and five carriages, good. And there's expected four, five commuters. I wonder if it, we'll have to spend some time um, experimenting with this. Does it pay just to call your trains as quick as possible, always? Or do you work out better waiting for the trains to fill up before calling them? I don't know. So we'll have to pay attention to that. Is everything going well today? We'll have, we'll be on the lookout for any commuters uh, spawning on top of our kiosk over there. What turns out what happened is they were going through this, the turnstile. They phased through this wall like it was a Harry Potter, Potter novel and then, um, and then spawned on top of that kiosk. It was really weird. You can go see the video. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty interesting. Let's get our Lexi back on now that she is in the right so she shows up as number two like she should be and she is tools information no not yet get your megaphone while you're in here there you go go do your job 
and she'll help them along. Litterbug. Water this so you can pick up your litter stick and then get the litter on the ground. Pigs. I put in, <laughs> of course, I put in uh, two trash cans and that's what happens. Okay. Okay, Phillips, unequip your watering can and go get your litter stick. And this is why I end up always hiring, putting, bringing in more staff is because I get tired of uh, sending them back there for new tools. But we're trying to be fiscally responsible today. And not, we want to make as much money as we can, as quickly as we can, uh, so we can expand. It's the fun part. And, Lewis, I imagine these are probably in a little better shape since we have two now. A vandal has entered the station. Um, do we need cameras? Do you remember the other day we had that vandal come off the train and Phillips didn't see it? And we presumed it was because of the turnstiles? Let's look and see what happens here. So we have our vandal over there. Oh, and she did see it. <laughs> Go fix what they broke. Good job. I don't know about those tasers, though. I think I liked it better when they beat them up. <laughs> Seems more sporting, don't you think? Uh, three bonds. Is that enough for a sofa? Yeah. Look at you guys. You're going to have some fancy stuff. I don't even think we're going to bother putting in a TV. We're going to have to have more staff rooms. as we play this level, as we expand. I mean, when we open this up and we start going all the way down to this side of the map, they're gonna need uh, break rooms and utility rooms to bring the trash, otherwise it'll be a mess. Bought drinks, a bargain. Somebody is not happy. Let's take a look at our reports and see what they're not happy about. Um, commerce, what on that kiosk don't they like? Rep today. I don't know, they seem fine. We're, we're gaining a lot of positive rep for our water, which I don't want to. Water and cigarettes. We're raising the prices of our water and cigarettes by a dollar, a pound, excuse me. Cigarettes, these people will pay anything. Fools. Okay, and water. That's. Oh, we can't raise it any higher than 25. <laughs> I guess that's a, a thief. I guess it's a law against uh, people like me trying to, uh, to fleece these poor customers. We really don't need Lewis here. Phillips would be absolutely fine running this station. Uh, but she's thirsty. Phillips, go get a drink while you can. And now come back out here. Because we have a thief. No sh Uh-oh, where's the thief? Did the thief disappear? I heard the music, but I did not see anybody get, uh... Anybody get robbed. Well, the thief is still around here somewhere, but there's not that many customers, so I don't know where. Over there? <laughs> and she's just... That's good.
If anyone plays this and has worked with the trains, do you wait until the arriving train fills up before you call it? Or do you just keep the trains coming as fast as possible? I would be interested in knowing that. We're getting a fair bit of money. A drunk has entered the station. Did they just come in with like and have green drunk text over their head? You pig. Do we want to juggle the equipment? Yeah, let's do it for a little bit longer. No. Are we really that hard up for money? I don't think we are. Let us. Do we want Ava Rose in? Let's bring in Wilson. Quit being lazy, just go get. Go get the mop I'm about to buy. Unequip the litter stick. Go get the mop. Go arrest this person, mop that up. Vomit spreads, spreads disease, I guess as you would expect. Mop that up. Am I missing something? Oh, say disease. Mop that up. <laughs> Mopped. Good job. Unequip the mop. Go get your litter stick. No. Nope. Ava Rose, get in here. Ava Rose. Get the watering can. <laughs> Get the watering can. Fix the plants. No shops. I'm really sorry about that, guy. I mean, we have a little kiosk. We have a hot dog stand. I thought we were doing pretty good. Why are my people so thirsty and full of despair? Let's watch Ava Rose over here and see how this uh, this plant works for her. Now we have despair. She's at 34 and yeah, it's just ticking down. It's, a, it's not as fast as a TV, but it is ticking down for her. That's pretty cool. So there you go. That tip absolutely works. Start repairing those so nothing breaks down. 76, 83, 75, 59. We should get the, we should get the second exit turnstile in. Yeah, we need, you know what we need? We need this, we need this second platform because we're not filling up this train. So we need more commuters, right? Right. Ava Rose, what's my hat? Ava Rose, now that I spent, we paid you all day to hang out in the break room, why don't you uh, go home? <laughs> and Lewis, you're the only one working. Go ahead and repair all this. We are going to do the evening chores and we are also going to, uh, we're going to get this station over here opened up because I think we can handle the commuters. So we want to do what? One, two, oh, well, we have to get all the way over to here. Well, let's do it, right? No use crying about it. Let's just, uh, let's get it done. Do we want to extend this further? I think we do, don't we? Let's bring this to this point. Oh, no. The other left. Is that? 
Is that even with this platform? It is. The only problem with that is now we're going to have to kind of patrol that area. So... And I would rather keep it on one floor, but when we go to expand this, we'll we'll fix it up. Okay, get it together. You know what you're doing. Uh, let's put in another entrance. We have the, what do we use? A light in the middle. How did we have this the last time? We had it going off to the side, didn't we? But we're not doing that this time, but I don't think it matters. Um, we'll do, oh, we, we can get escalators, can't we? Do we have enough bonds for that? We want es. oh no, eight bonds. Let's wait to open this up until we can get escalators because I mean, there's no reason to put in steps when you know why. Yeah, so let's, we'll be putting in escalators, but let's put a, a light here to light that up. And what is our power usage? I don't know. Exciting times, right? Phillips. Get over it. You're not that tired. Uh, some people were tired. There was vomit. Teeniest tiny bit of overcrowding. Still high prices, but we are not changing that. Um, our aesthetic is still good. I, I hate to say this. I hate to say this. Uh, but plants are probably probably a little bit too too nice. Although I don't know. I don't know how the game should be balanced. From what I've seen, some people really have a hard time keeping their reputation up, so maybe they're not uh, overbalanced, <laughs> a little OP, I don't know. But they, they seem a little bit. I hate to have stuff nerfed though. What was I looking at this report for? I don't remember, but here it is. The magazines are too expensive. Let's drop the magazines down by a tick. Magazines, the sweets. We sold zero sweets at this price. We sold none and people don't like the price. So let's, let's drop the sweets by two pounds. What else can we glean from this report over here? Um, our water is a bargain. We don't want a bargain. Let's raise that back up. Our water and our cigarettes are a bargain, but we can't help that. But you can pay more for your water. What else? We're not touching our ticket prices because we all know how that goes. And they think they're too high already, but yeah. We're just gonna leave the ticket prices alone. Uh, cash machine is a bargain. We'll raise that up a tick. Crisps are a bargain. Newspapers are a bargain. We don't want, we don't really want any bargains. Let's raise them up a, a pound each. ATM, let's raise that up a pound. Does that look good? I think so. We, now that we have almost the full length of our platform, let's put up some commerce posters. You know what we should be doing? We haven't addressed heat at all yet. We're still good, but I noticed this the other day that you can fit these little vents in the corners. So, eh. Let's put a vent over here. This is probably gonna get expanded though, so we're not gonna do that. But let's get in some of our commerce signs.
Drinks. 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 Newspaper, newspaper, newspaper. That is good. We're going to be putting an air conditioner in this machine room, and that is going to cool down this section, so we don't need to worry about vents on that side. Now, do you know how when our staff fail at a task, they it creates despair? Does walking in the dark do anything to them? Does constantly using the megaphone do something to them? I wonder if there's anything else that impacts our, our staff. So we're waiting for one more bond to open up that entrance. We expanded our platform, so it's uh, pretty respectable in size. The next step would to be to increase loading by from both sides, I think, would be the next logical uh, progression there. And I guess, I guess we're going to not care about building during the day. Do you want to know why? Because uh, at night, I have to spend so much time like clicking each one of these things, making sure they do what they're supposed to. Well, not what they're supposed to, what I'd like done. That during the day, it just, it naturally feels better to, uh, to take care of this stuff during the day when the staff is largely autonomous. As weird as that seems. Okay, Lexi, are you good now? What about your stats? Do you know what, Lexi? Go home. Go home. So I don't have to worry about you. Is everything repaired? No, it wasn't. Lexi? Oh, what about applicants? We don't really need anybody. We have eight people, which is a ton. But we'll keep an eye out if anyone really good shows up. Oh, don't tell me this. Okay, this is not going to work. She can't get down. Um. Oh, shit. Who's our backup repair? Lexi is our main repair. 30, not 61. James Johnson. Didn't you eat? Did I not take care of these people before uh, closing? last time we'll get the tool get the toolkit first toolkit first we're gonna need another trash can down here because you know pigs toolkit the f the watering can is fun stuff. Go water that. And then water the plant in the break room. Johnson, that's good enough. Come come repair stuff. I really like that those plants you can put like little plants in the break room. <laughs> it's like the simmer in me. <laughs> Phillips is really is uh, really having a hard time watering that plant. Did you repair all that? Good, do that. Okay, Phillips, unequip the watering can. Go get your litter picker back. Please, if you would be so kind. Johnson, get started on the ticket machines guy. Um, go get a drink. Good. Thank you for coming in, Johnson. I know it was your day off. Repair a 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. Oh, it looks like, remember that vandal attacked this trash can? It looks like they slowly gained their reputation back, or like their condition back. That's pretty neat. Right? Yeah, it's neat. What time? You know what? 
Go get the gas can. See if you can't fill up some of these machines before uh, we pay for the gas. And then you can go, then you can go home after this, Johnson. But thank you very much. We should, I'm sorry you can't fill the generator though. I thought we were beyond these newbie mistakes here. Nope, look at you. You're a mess, you're a mess, Johnson. Go get something to eat. And then as soon as we buy the escalator, we'll bring Lexi back on. Oh, I guess you're gonna need to... Yeah, their, um... Their despair ticks down nicely. Okay, Phillips. Unequip that, you are on rat catching duty. Let's go take care of that. Johnson, and now you're thirsty. Get a drink, Johnson. Yeah, the water cooler released uh, 20 thirst. The tea station only uh, only 10. Let's get some people in. Unequip that and get your litter stick because you know someone is throwing litter on the ground. It's what these people do. It's a nice plant, isn't it? It's a very nice plant. We have to be on the lookout for people walking through the walls. Phillips, I know you want to hide in there. I would want to hide in there too, but no, come out here. Let's get these uh, commuters moving. You can't afford the ticket. I don't think we're going to reduce the, our ticket prices anymore. I think by the time we have three stations over, like the people that can't afford a 10 pound ticket, I mean, we'll just have to lose their business, right? These commuters are supposed to be pretty flush with gas, I thought. Oh my gosh. <laughs> awesome. I do love a little commuter rage. Are you going to take care of the blood now too? There you go. Good job. <laughs> you almost didn't make it, guy. He's get, he's regenerating his health pretty quickly. Do we have eight bonds yet? No, we do not. When do we get more bonds? We need to shift seven more commuters over this little tiny screen up here 353 out of 360 when that fills up we'll generate more bonds is it looking good good job leveling up there phillips and you know what let's give her, let's start working on giving her a little We'll do perception, then stamina, because this is, by the time we're out of here, it's gonna be a big station. And we have nine bonds, and... Do we, let's just do it, right? Things are gonna get crazy as soon as we open up this station, but I don't care, it'll be fun. And it's also 12 o'clock, so if things go really bad, uh, the station will be closing soon, so it don't matter. <laughs> Uh, let's get the escalator. Good. And let's put it in. Is this where we want them or do we want them on this side? I think this side. In the middle. Right over here. And we saw this tooltip before, which I thought was really nice. Um, you can change the speed of the escalators by right clicking on them slower and you'll get more rep, faster and you have more throughput. Too fast and you might make commuters sick or panic. I thought they got, they rested. Escalators make people less tired and generate reputation. Okay, so it does. So this will help with our need for rest. Let's uh, spin around here. 
we want this to go to platform one, correct? Correct. We have a light. We want a camera up here. Utilities, yes. A camera, and do we put a trash can? I think we do. Cause pigs, right? Right. And that is about as much as we can cram on that little three tiles. And let's open it. Let's do it. Are we ready? Come flooding in, guys. Flooding in. That's right. They're rested on that. Maybe we need to make this just a little bit faster. I think we do. Is that too fast for you guys? Just the tick faster. Um, actually, I think we need no seat. I think we need two. Rip, rip. We have to move this. Sorry. Oh. And platform one, and we wanted to make this go just a tick faster. Do we have power for all this stuff? Let's look at our power report. Let's get back to our right camera angle. Call this in. Phillips, what's going on? Have we lost the plot yet? And now we can call Lexi in, which is good because Lexi is also our customer service person. These two, they were such good early picks that we got from them. Tools first, please. Oh, see? I knew we needed uh, Lewis. Information, nope, 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 not yet. But I appreciate your initiative there. Go help a commuter out. Good job. It's funny that as soon as I called her in, everyone needs help. And are things still ticking along here? I think they are. No, they're not. It's a power outage. Uh, those escalators, I mean, we were playing it pretty close to the wire anyway. Um, I wish they would group everything together. Like, how are these sorted? Are they sorted by price? I'm not sure, but I wish, like all the generators together, the wheelie bins, that sort of thing. Another one of those, please. We just had enough money for that. If that would have happened, um, we could have reduced the number of carriages on our train to reduce until we got enough money to buy another generator. I'm also interested in the capacitors. Uh, we never have them because, I mean, usually our utility rooms are only big enough to store the generators, but we'll have to have more uh, utility closets around the station. So we can try putting some uh, capacitors in them and see how that works out. Might be nice. Lewis has leveled up. Didn't she just level up? Um, we're gonna keep going with the stamina for her. Thief has entered the station. Let's get our train in here. The next step is to have them load from this side of the platform and then and then we'll be ready for our other train tracks because this looks like a good healthy amount of a good healthy amount of commuters right come up here and see if we can't help these people on the train get everybody going where they need to be And since we already 
are building during the day when we're not supposed to be. Let's take a look at that, by the way. Just for curiosity's sake. Facility not powered, so sorry. Theft, knocked out, vandalism, moving objects. Construction loss. This is a new, absolutely a new negative reputation. I like it. Um, I think a little bit more negative. I mean, because we maintain 100% reputation pretty darn easily. Probably too easy for a hard mode if, you know, if we're being honest with ourselves here. But all of that will be balanced out. Let's do it. Since we just put in that generator, we should have power now for that. I like it. So we have a hot dog stand, coffee cart, little kiosk, two entrances, two employees. We're really, uh... We're really setting the world on fire here today. I do enjoy this game. Uh, but I'm very much interested in where it's going to go. I know the dev has uh, other things planned, like new objects. Uh, the first thing, he's, he's working on all of the crashes. And like I said, I have not had a crash on this game since the first weekend. So I assume he's doing a good job fixing all of, the, all of that. Um, the next step after that is he is going to put in some quality of life uh, features for the staff. It feels a lot of people don't like the, you know, the equipping and unequipping of the tools and that sort of thing. Um, we want to adjust the thresholds on things a little bit. So all of that will be nice. 57, 57, 56. Oh, we wanted to get another turnstile. And then another exit turn style. Oh. And I mean, they're saying that it's crowded up there, but I don't. They're fine. They're just crybabies. We'll be expanding this platform eventually. And you know, since it's there, let's do. Whoops. We can't keep that there because I don't like it like that. <laughs> Since we have this wall, really, the sooner you get adverts in, I mean, the sooner they make back their money. So it's foolish not to uh, wallpaper everything with these. Good job. And this is why I like... Um, you know what? We are going to call in Refuse Security. No, we just need we just need this. We're going to call Ava Rose in to um, pick up the watering can and let her take care of the plants instead of fumbling around with the tools. Lewis, Lewis, come down here on this platform. Get everybody where they're going. And we are filling up this train, so that is good. Someone has the flu, but Philip should be on it. Good. And one of the things I thought that when the plants turned brown here, that you got a negative reputation for them for being unwatered, but that's not the case. There is still more time um, before they die. That's when they would give a negative uh, reputation. It does not matter if they're unwatered. But I think that was a very good day. We have a, a good start to a nice bustling station. We have two entrances. Still only one track, but we're working it. And uh, yeah, but that is going to be all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for your likes and your comments. I do appreciate them. And I hope to see you for the next one. Bye-bye.